Welcome back everyone to Strategic Command World War One as the Central Powers. We're back with Germany on the Western Front, which is looking better by the day. And I wanted to check out the French morale. It's actually at 7%. It has not gone down, surprisingly. And the UK morale has actually been increased because they destroyed one of our dreadnoughts. Okay. Well, that means we definitely need to go forward. And I'm thinking about attacking this town. Yep. Because um, that will reduce their supply and stuff like that. Now, other than that, I wanted to switch you out, probably. We also have three shells. Uh, we also have this new unit. Um, let's uh, deploy it here. We'll bring you over to the front line. And then, I think... You have eight entrenchment. We have six shells. Yeah, I believe we'll just have to... Um... We'll have to go after this one now. Right? Yeah. Okay, I escort's dealing two damage. Losing one. Okay. So that was actually went quite well. And then let's shoot our shots. We won't reduce all the entrenchment, but um, it's going to be fine. I mean, taking a little bit of damage here is no problem. Just keep going. All right, that's all we had because you cannot reach there, unfortunately. 2-5. One six, one five, one six. Then let's do this one six. Seven, one seven, one two. Okay, zero one. Then you go into Apinal. You can. Well, I could entrench you. Um, I can also upgrade you. Let's get you the weapons. Mm, you can get the new weapons. Let's do that first. It's a bit of a priority. And you move up. Um, and then... I can attack, but I think I'm rather going to fortify my position. So we now have all of this under control. You can even get your elite reinforcement. Nice. You have really good elite units. Okay, then over here, I think I'm just... I have six shells against your six entrenchments, so we'll just, yeah, shoot you down. No problem there. And then we'll be able to bring our artillery into tool. By the way, who do you command, von Falkenhayn? All kinds of dudes. All right, interesting. The range is quite incredible on those guys. Um, and one last shell. Two damage. Wow. Okay. Holy smokes. Um, yep. Might as well attack. And good night. Didn't even take damage. But I'm um, going to move you in. So that we get the trenches right. Move you in here. Uh, well, I guess. Yeah, whatever. We'll move you here and then the artillery can move on forward. Um, bring you here. You can move south. Supply should be looking awesome. Okay, so we took Epinal, we took uh, out another French corps. That uh, made them lose 1% morale. Then here, let me upgrade your weapons first. I can always... If you're on the front line, I can still give you reinforcements, but I can't give you weapon upgrades. Um, I attacked with you. You are kind of far away. This cav definitely needs to be reinforced. And this one probably as well. Might as well do it. You're kind of weak. We still have one cav that can do something. And then here... Mm, 
Probably you want to go after the French one. 2-9. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 1-9. Goodbye. Took the damage. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, move the cab back, move you here, move you here, move you here, and do a bit of a switcheroo, just like that, you guys switch as well, whoops, I didn't want to purchase anything, I just wanted to do this. Upgrade. Perfect. And then you can go in here. You will be able to upgrade later. And I guess I can send my cav here. It will be useful eventually. Okay. Yeah. Destroyed more French cores. Did that? Yeah, you're at 5% now. Oh. Um... Might as well bombard this too. Yes, there we accept this. I actually reduced your experience. Hmm. But it's now back to three. Okay. And you can now reinforce. Let's do that. Oh, only two? Why? Huh? Why only two? Why, why is your supply five? That makes no sense. Why would, why would your supply be five? Hmm. That is strange. I don't know. But I'm, I'm sure there's a reason for that. Okay. So, there is the fleet thing. I mean, our sub is going to sink this battle cruiser. But where is... The rest of the fleet, huh? Go into raid mode. Ah, uh, two light cruisers. There is, there is this, but that isn't all I was looking for. You have to be really careful. This dreadnought and this cruiser is basically about to sink. Um, I have three destroyers here. Do I have any other ship that can maybe deal with this destroyer? No. Not really. They all got sunk. All my armored cruisers got sunk. I have this battle cruiser. Ugh. I kind of need to pull back some of my forces. These two I want to sink though. The question is... Where are these dreadnoughts? Ah, uh, you know what's kind of stupid? I can't find them. Let's just go here. Let's attack those that I can find. Good. Okay. There's the two French carriers. Go for the light cruisers. Okay, there's another destroyer. That hurts. Send this submarine here. Okay. So far, so good. This destroyer. Axe the sub. Uh, rather not. Hmm. My, my ships. My nice ships. 
Submarines can't attack submarines. Sadly. There was... There's more Dreadnoughts. I want to hunt the Dread... I want to find and hunt down the Dreadnoughts. That's... That's what I want to do. You have attacked. Let's go here. You have not attacked yet. Hmm. I don't find anything. Well, I can definitely go here. And... Here. And here. I need to pull you guys back. Uh, okay, nice, get rid of the destroyer, on the way, okay, we're relatively safe here, relatively, let's check with this submarine, what we can find, in this region, okay, seems to be relatively clear, I'm going to bring these guys back because, oh, I'm afraid what's going to happen to them. Um, and I might even bring you out. Just so I can see. All right. I think we might be able to at least save this Dreadnought. This battle cruiser, and this Dreadnought. Whew. Okay. We're back. Almost back home. Almost back in the safety of our own territory, then I'm gonna pull back. I'm gonna pull you back. I'm gonna pull you back. Send you here, attack. Two damage. And then. You go here, and then. All the way. All the way here. Oh my goodness. This is actually sketchy. I'll move you back. You can't move back. So some of our subs will be hunted. And... You... I will move back. Here. I have mostly submarines here, but that's also because the rest was sunk. Hmm. Okay. There is their destroyer. Uh, their dreadnought. The Emperor of India. How many do you have? Alright. Let's go over here. They have so many. Phew. Okay. I think our uh, subs will be relatively safe, though. Let's quickly check the reports. We have 18 ships for the UK, 24 for Germany. Yeah, our navy looks better and better. By the way, can I send you... Can I make you... Cr oh, I can cruise you. I can make you... Um, how, how do I... Can I do it with shift? Shift click. Oh, yeah, that works. Good. Then let's cruise this way. And then, yeah. There we go. Do I not get um, to reveal anything? That's kind of awkward. How about now? All right. How did you not reveal this? You literally ran through that, but okay. Yeah, we have screens for you. And I wanted to use you up here. I remember. All right, hold on. 
let's send one of our planes out. Okay, so yeah, I can scout the area. That's kind of interesting. Not super amazing, but okay, I'll take it. Mm, Staten is now unprotected, but I feel like that's okay. Yeah, this destroyer I can't deal with. Our ships are just too, too damaged. I mean, look at this. This battle cruiser limping back into port. The Rhineland Dreadnought as well. This battle cruiser. This Dreadnought, and then we have another Dreadnought over here. I mean, they're at 5 strength. Um, that's okay, but yeah. One attack, they're lost. They just need to go back. Good. So that's the fleet. Um, we can reinforce here. Let's, let's do that, actually, with the tool. Reinforce. You reinforce as well. And then here, I'm actually thinking... Upgrade. Upgrade? Oh, no, it does the wrong upgrade, doesn't it? It gave you mobility now. Alright, never mind then. Then I just want the regular one. Don't have enough points to waste on mobility over here, and I don't need it at this, in this front. Okay, you reinforce normally. And... Yeah, don't need mobility. Not here. Okay, then you somehow... Oh, you still have... Ah, right, you still have supply over this way. That's okay, though. You can reinforce. Ah, uh, it's going to take a while till we're ready to do anything here. And reinforce, please. Two, four. Actually, you have six shells for five entrenchment. Alright, we'll just... um. Use our artillery shells for this, and we only have one, one attack. So it better be good. Well, I guess we can attack with our detachments, if needs be. Two damage there. Zero six, looks like a charm. Now, this is amazing, because now I can get new weapons here. Because there's no enemy, uh, they're basically on the front line anymore. Sweet. And we'll just leave it like that. You can reinforce. Okay, we have 100 points left. 100 points left means... Oh. I can go here. And I can back go back to Toronto. Wow. I took Brindisi, Toronto, and that stops this route, basically. Pretty powerful. I wonder if this uh, ship here was actually stopped. Let's go to hunting mode. And um, let's entrench here. Let's see if anyone ever comes. We have three ports under control. I like it. And then this submarine I'll utilize. Hmm. Okay. We can throw down a mine. Maybe I will do that over here. Just to see what happens. We basically have full control over this now. We have the uh, German subs. <sighs> Obviously we have Cyprus, we have this now. Uh, might as well upgrade you, extra infantry. There is a pre-dreadnought for, oh, Greece has a fleet. I was not aware. And then 1 3 attack. Oh, yeah, Ottomans can't really do anything here. Then let's just have them move in. Not even sure if they will be able to take 
Athens next time, but I hope they will be able to. Uh, it doesn't matter if they take back Kalamata here, really, is, uh, is not a thing. That worries me. Now, I'm gonna send out my Dreadnought here. Deal with that destroyer. Still took the damage. Uh, let's move you back here, just for safety. Then we can have the pre-Dreadnought finish it off. Nice. Let's go back. I guess I could have gone to this port. That's fine. And then let's maybe bring... Bring our navy up. Here. Specifically the armored cruiser. There we go. And yeah, Germany's just taken over southern Italy. No the fence they're not even trying like this is the weird thing they're not even trying anything just standing around letting this happen all right now germany has almost no points left but i think we pretty much did everything we could right no artillery has any shells and i don't want to attack without artillery so this seems fine with me. You know, I'm going to um, switch the entrenchment, rotate, because they don't ever usually attack us up here, they usually attack us up here. Did we? Oh, we didn't do this yet. Alright. Um, I can't do anything with my Artillery here. We want Rovno. Or, well, it doesn't really matter. We can just take this. Let's quickly check the uh, supply. Supply would be six here. Let's scout. And let's, yeah, let's check the supply then. Five, three, six. Okay, so now we have, we have, you know... We have this under control. Um, I need to make sure that we are properly protecting this. You, I'm going to reinforce. This cav, probably as well. You... You could go here. Here? Hmm. I think this is probably a good defensive position. You go here. It's hard to say from where they will attack me. Probably this could be possible. And then... Probably here. I want to be ready. Uh, let's just entrench like this. I don't know. We can always get attacked from the rear, but there's not much I can do about that. You reinforce here. Hmm. I do get to attack here. That's a possibility. But I only have three shells. You know what? I'll use this opportunity to reinforce you. We'll reinforce... Hmm. I kind of have to make sure that we are not cut off here. So I'll have to... Keep a line of communications up and running. You will now defend like this. And then, are we even entrenched up here? No. Well, let's make sure you do that. There you go. Can't move. I could move you here. Yeah, let's do that. Let's shift over. Let's do it. Then you hold this. There we go. And you 
can reinforce. And over here, it doesn't matter as much. But I'll, uh... I mean, the cav can hold this. That's not really a problem. Plus, all of you guys standing nicely. Okay. And then next turn, we can do something here with you. And what's the supply six? I might just move here to check out what they have. We are, you know, behind a river. So we're generally in a good position. They would have to go this way where we have no entrenchment and no river. I mean, we could be cut off, but that would be a huge effort. I don't think they will go through that. I'm hoping, anyway. Alright, that is you. We can't really do much else here. I think um, you will die in the next turn. Did I attack? No. We still have this Italian front, right. I wanted to break Bologna. Mm, I guess we'll attack Parma now. Yeah, might as well take Parma, and then we'll move here. I cannot utilize you, unfortunately. Alright. Well, we have 10 shells, though. Let's make sure we now switch our mode. I can... 6 entrenchment. If I attack you, we can actually move in. And... Yeah, let's do that then. Let's focus on you guys. Six shells for you. It's just a detachment. And it's a French one, which is actually pretty good. Because if they lose... They will lose national morale for every unit that's destroyed. Good. Um, one seven. One eight. One eight. One six, though. No damage. Kind of annoying. Okay. Got you with that, at the le at the very least. Mm. I could... I need to entrench this. But then again, do I really need to? If I go here, we can probably attack and with both cores destroy. But I don't actually want to destroy that. I want to go here. To Parma. You haven't attacked. So let's move you in here. I mean... I mean... It's another French unit that's destroyed. I think that's worth it. Same here, really. Two damage, kind of annoying. But okay. I could move you back. But there's... Well, there is the reason that this unit could move in. And finish this core. Oh. French morale at 4%. Damn. Alright, we can... Can we switch you out? No. Oh, you're not, next, you're not next to each other. Then... Let's do it like this. And you'll be able to upgrade to an elite core in the next turn. Man, we have so many elites. It's kind of, kind of amazing. Alright, we have three shells. We'll wait for those. You can entrench over here while you wait. I don't really attack. I don't really want to attack more. I do want to go after you and Parma. Parma next. But I need to be able to use my plane. In fact, 
Let's move it down here. Hopefully next time that will be better. And we'll have both of our planes here. Just hope that it doesn't rain again. Then... Is that all we can really do? Yeah. I think that's pretty much it. Unless there's research to be done? Nope. With the Germans, yes. But Germans already lack in points. Okay, then it's the Ottoman turn. This poor fighter can be upgraded. Problem is supply has actually been damaged yeah this primary supply has been damaged by the uh, by that plane so I need to protect it because this is very annoying now I guess I switch you out You can get the infantry weapons. And then we'll see what we can do here. It's just... Yeah. It's just standing still. This is frustrating. 1-2. One, 2-2. Two, two, two. We are entrenched. One. Oh. It's not amazing. Do I want to deal the damage? Or rather entrench myself. I think entrench for now. And then see what happens next turn. Because their morale isn't high. Our morale's a lot higher. I just hope that you will run out of supplies uh, soon. And I hope that our headquarter here can defend. I'm not so sure about that though. Okay, and then here, 2-4 against this, kind of interesting. We have 3 entrenchment, we have 5 shells. I want to take Port Said. Let's go and fly. Yes, yes, yes. It's fine. We'll have no entrenchment. There's another core behind that. Oh my god. Two, two. I can switch you out, but... Hmm. I will do it. I'll just use all my shells. And then attack first. Ask questions later. 2-1. How? 2-3? Okay. No! What? Come on. It's bogus. You can go in here. Question is, will you be able to go in here? Probably not. You, however, mm. man, that's annoying. That's actually really annoying because I don't really want to give up this position. <sighs> two zero, two two. Uh, all of this is super frustrating. They still have so many cores. I can't kill it, really. I don't know what I can do. I really thought we could destroy this detachment. The problem is I can move in, but then there will be zone of control, which will uh, not allow me to go in. This is four action. We have five action points, but then that will cost us two to get there, which means I can I can deal the damage, but it's it's not worth it. So I don't think I will. I think I'm just going to attack this. Yep. And... No, there's no point in moving there unless... Well, I mean, I could potentially kill this core. But honestly, I don't know. You have a morale of 39. You have a morale of 60. Yeah, so this is not going to happen. 
Nope. Nope. There's nothing else we can do. There's nothing else we can do here. As the ornaments. What is... Uh, are we getting any new production coming in? Yes, we are getting a core in November. Hmm. Oh, by the way, is Germans... Are we not getting a core back? Oh, this is the Ottoman Empire. Never mind. Didn't someone lose something? I guess it's just... Um, nah, it was just ships. Okay. Well, well, well. You were all upgraded. You cannot be upgraded. I guess I could wait for another headquarter that I could maybe send down there. So that we have another headquarter here. Maybe? How much is it going to cost? Kemal Pasha, 390. Mm. Or we could uh, check out more of this research. Maybe I will do it actually. You know? Why not? We'll save the points. Unless there's diplomatic things we can do. No. And then for Austria, we have so many points left. It's not even funny anymore. Is there really nothing I can purchase with you? I guess another artillery? Hmm. I mean, because there's no research I can do with you either. Hey, you just have too many points, Austria. Give them to Germany, maybe. We'll get the fighter for this. Hmm. I honestly don't know what to do. What can I do with these points? I have too many. Uh, I mean, I tell we never hurts. 360? We have that. We have that. Alright. Another artillery it is. For Austria. And then... Germany... You... Aerial warfare. Armored warfare. We are getting this armored... Uh, we're getting the tank. With tank development, fighter development could be better. Industrial technology, gas and shell production, trench warfare, amphibious warfare, aerial, all of this is happening. I think one more fighter development it is. There we go. And that's all the points we have here. Is there really nothing I can go for as the Ottomans? I mean, I can go for naval weaponry. Or, if, you know what? Let's do naval weaponry for the few ships we do have. And then let's go more fighter development. Because, yeah, we need that. Okay. I don't like not spending my points unless i'm really saving up for something but a new headquarter would be nice but it, it would take so long to save up for it then to a to be able to deploy it and then to actually send it there like uh neapolitan territorial militia is mobilized good for them and switzerland oh some diplomatic success there we'll keep investing there and a national referendum, Australia votes against introducing conscription. 50,000 more men will... Will you help us keep that promise? Australia has promised Britain. Okay. The German flying ace Oswald Bölke is killed in a mid-air collision. Hmm. Industrial attack 2. Infantry weapons attack 2. Control and command. Gas and shell production. Aerial warfare. Naval warfare development. Good for Austria Hungary. And the Ottomans. Just hope that our fleet makes it back to port. <laughs> At least our capital ships. Italy forms a Czecho Slovak volunteer corps. It's not gonna save them. 
Okay, that cab has fully reinforced. Uh, freaking destroyer. Dealing damage, obviously. I need to get my subs out. Okay, we um, go from the attack. I like how we have that <laughs> mine up there. It's kind of funny. Oh. What do you want? Oh no, this cav is threatening Hindenburg. Can we capitulate Greece already? They're alive for way too long here. I think next turn it will be possible. We'll have one prepared attack, one regular. Ah, uh, well, maybe not. Another enemy contact. No damage, though. Come on. I just upgraded you. Oh, God. This fight is terrible. Okay, Baghdad being bombarded. It's really kind of annoying. I hope we can hold that. Yeah, a second artillery here against Italy would actually be helpful. Oh, we took damage. Hmm. Not over here, though. Wow! How can you still attack? That is actually... That hurts. And that hurts as well. Going after my headquarter there. Damn it. Now they can... Now Baghdad is surrounded. That is not good. Damn it! Ah, oh, man. That is really bad. I don't know what... I, if they break through, which they, you know, technically already have in a way, I don't know what to do. I mean, they're... I mean, they, you gotta be... You gotta have zero supply, bro. Like, how do you have any supply? It's impossible. I like that our headquarters so far has held, but... Man... Only two units. There's this freaking submarine. I definitely want to deal with that one. Now, if we if we're done with Greece, oh no, the USA. Joining the Entente. Woodrow Wilson is re-elected. Good for him. Yeah, you are actually... You, you've got to be out of supply right there. Zero. Yep. Ton of bombings. Volunteer Corps. Russia and UK losing some more morale. And the US. Oh, we have the Asia Corps. Oh my, that's actually really good. Um, I'm going to have to bring you... Well, what's the fastest way? Probably... Here? And then, yeah. March down there. You do have the extra action points, so that's nice. I hope we can do this, man. Seriously. Okay, but anyway. Um, actually, that was already the next turn. I, I usually wait with that. But for now, that was definitely it. I'm going to end it here, and I'll see you guys next time.